here we be, Cully. Did you enjoy the voyage? Very much so. Thank you. Now, let's go see the Shi'ark in charge. Ah, the showmeister. He be at the building at the center of town. Hmm. No way I'm getting this done on my own. Hmm? You there! Knock, knock! Who's at the door? Why, it's opportunity! Will you answer? Uh, depends on the door? Hmm, yeah, it's kinda... It's big game stuff. In fact, maybe a little too big for you. I better find someone tougher. Forget I said anything. Sorry to waste your time. Uh, any idea what that was about? None. I vote we ignore her and go talk to the showmeister. We'll be meeting with Shulmeister Skid. Oh, and Shulmeister is what the Shi'arks call their leader. The Shi'arks are fellow mercenaries I'm on good terms with, so I'm thinking Skid should at least lend us an... ear? Just be aware, we approach fighting with something of a different mindset than we do. What do you mean? War means different things to different people, and everyone's got a reason for taking lives and risking their own. For me and my kind, war is simply a way to put food on the table, and the only life we've ever known, for the most part. For the Shi'arks, though? Different. How exactly? Probably better for you to hear it from the source. Let's get inside. Guess I never really thought about it that way. Basically, you'd be wanting us to join your battle against the Empire. Yes. Duke Aldrich is plotting a war of conquest against the League, for no reason other than to sate his ambitions. We're gathering allies to fight back. This be no wee skirmish, Cully. Sounds like any joining your side would be risking their very lives. Do you disagree, in Barnard? No, I think you have the right of it. Not that that would amount to a particularly novel situation for us mercenaries. The Sawads are already contracted to you, Chris, and may the sands swallow us if we ever break a contract. Yar. <sighs> like selling sawdust to a lumber mill. Thank you for inviting us to participate in so glorious a war. Uh, does that mean you'll help us? Aye, but on one condition. 
For there be no glory to be found in a war if the commander has no valor. Which means we need to see your worth, by champ. Will you prove it to us now or no? Of course I will. <laughs> I applaud your conviction, Noah. Wasn't sure you'd agree quite so readily. So, how do you expect him to do this, Skid? The Shiarcraft race! The Shiarcraft race! Uh, they race those things? So if we want the Shi'arks as our allies, I have to win this race? Skid didn't say anything about winning it. I think an adequately impressive performance should be enough. Fascinating. I say we take part. He said we could register for the race at the town square, right? Hear ye! The Shiarcraft race is on! It be open to all, so dive in if your courage be fine! No experience? No problem! We'll teach ye the ropes, show your valor with dorsal fin held high! This be the path to true Shiark glory! That seems to be the place. Sure does. Just know that Shiarcraft races can get pretty rough as you zip through the dunes. Right. To hell with it. Here we go. Look, you're here to enter the race! Aye, this be a rare sight, <laughs> but an impressive one. Uh... Oh, no worries, Cully. I'll personally train ye into a proper Shiarcraft captain. <laughs> I be... You Eupharius the Seventh. But you'll be calling me coach by chum. Now, get ready and keep up. W wait. Hmm. That's sound judgment from the Schulmeister. I'll just have to work ye that much harder. Ah, now then, what be your name? It's Noah, coach. <laughs> Excellent response, Noah. Our training begins now. Be ye ready! You bet I'm ready, coach. Then your training starts now. Yes, coach. Teach us, coach. We'll be like sponges. Uh, for sand. Sand sponges. Whoa, that concludes our training. Very impressive, Cully. Thank you, coach. Now rest up at the inn, so ye be ready for the race tomorrow. Yes, coach. I'm ready to hustle, coach. 
He seems strangely at home in the sands. Let's get you some rest before you collapse. Where is this inn? The Rippling Sands. Rest well, my chum. Go get yourself a good night's rest. And don't get so excited about the race you don't sleep, all right? I hear you. But I'm really fired up about it. It's gonna be so much fun! <laughs> Just take it easy, Tiger. This next race is something special. Has me trembling with excitement down to the tip of me tail fin. We be having a special racer today. He sent the imps running at his shine, and now he leads the alliance. He be the one, the only, the Noah. Go on, play to the crowd. This Kelly is going to war against the Empire, and he be asking for the help of the Shi'arks. But first, he's going to prove his valor on the sands. This race be telling us whether he's got the teeth or he's all fin. <laughs> Now, let the race begin! This be it, Cully. This be what you trained for. Yes, Coach. Of course, Coach. I'm gonna hustle and win, Coach. Uh, maybe reel that enthusiasm in a bit. Just try to hit second place. That should be more than enough to impress them. Got it. If your fins be groomed and sharp, let's go! Let me at him, coach! <laughs> then go give him hell! I think I did it! <laughs> I must admit, I'm impressed. <laughs> spectacular, Cully! Absolutely spectacular! What a battle! And such incredible spirit, my champ! Rarely have I seen a dorsal fin stand so tall. Three cheers for Noah! You ran an incredible race, Cully, and we see your valor fair and true. Then you're satisfied? I am. We Shi'arks would be honored to join your alliance. We'll show ye how a shoal of Shi'arks can chew apart even so mighty a foe as the Empire. Thank you very much. You did it, Noah. I guess it was worth coming all this way after all. And since a valorously run race deserves a prize to match, this be for you. And 
I have something more. The greatest gift we Shi'arks can bestow. Fine work, Cully. You're clearly a man worthy to be entrusted with me life. Coach? Not anymore, Cully. Just call me Eupharius. We Shi'ark stand ready to fight whenever ye be needing us. As such, we be giving ye our finest warrior and the head of our defense force, Eupharius the Seventh. And I'll be serving ye with as much sandpapery grit as I got on me own skin. <laughs> Thank you all. It'll be me pleasure to fight at your side, Noah. It's an honor to have you, Co- Oh, <laughs> I mean, Eupharius. So, the Alliance's castle be that way, Yar. Let's hustle! Is he gonna be okay? Looks like he intends to cross the desert by himself. Which reminds me, we should probably be heading back as well. Emperor Shi'ark Self-Defense Force Captain, Eupharius VII, reporting for duty. It's a pleasure to have you. Well, I guess our work is done. Thanks to you, we can now call upon the Shi'aks for aid. That just leaves Sane's group. I wonder how they're faring. Their operation remains underway, Mom. In fact, I was just about to return to the Empire to check on their progress. Have I leave to depart? Go ahead, Hildy. Although knowing Sane, I bet he's doing just fine. I am sure you're correct, sir. I'll return with good news as swiftly as possible.